going to do is for now, we're just going to wait for, for about three to five minutes, just wait for everyone to sign into the live, and then hopefully once everyone's ready, we can start the viewing, okay? Hi everyone! Everyone ready? Fenton ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Let's go. Brilliant. Okay, so my name's Fenton. This is Tina, who's behind the camera at the moment. So, obviously, at the moment, we're outside Chaucer House. And then, when we're ready, we'll just go into reception. As you can see, it's a lovely area outside the front here. Very nice. Brilliant. Okay, should we go indoors to the reception, yeah? Cool. As you can see, the post boxes are behind me. The reception's to my left. And we have some ping pong tables and just some activities just to my right here. I just want to say as well, just before we start doing everything directly, if you have any questions, please feel free to just drop them inside the chat and preferably in English if that's okay, because then it's easier for us to just answer them. Okay. Someone just said painting on the wall is cool. That's that was done by a local artist in Portsmouth, guys. Yes. There's also another one just down here on the left, as you can see. Very nice. Yes, so we have in our reception area we like to also use it as like a common area for students. So you guys can chill down here as long as you want. We have a ping pong table here, pool table over there. So I have the three vending machines just here. And we're fortunate enough to have a Ben and Jerry's vending machine, which is incredible. Students love that. Okay. So, with the post boxes, I'll explain that we have our parcel system. So if any students order parcels, they'll come to reception down here. And any small parcels that you receive will go inside your letterbox and you'll receive a key for your letterbox. And any larger parcels that don't necessarily fit inside your postbox will go behind reception and then you can pick your, uh, your parcel up from behind reception. Okay? Please let us know if you can hear us. Sally, this is Matt, We're currently working very hard to try and get you guys to come to us next year. <laughs> okay. Should we go to the laundry machines? We're just currently on our way to the laundry machine our laundry facilities. We might uh, miss you guys a little bit because the signal in here isn't great, but please let us know if you can still see us. So, as you can see on the left, this is our washing machine services. So you can access the washing machines via your My Unite app. So every, every customer that stays with us, when they arrive to check in, you'll download a My Unite app and you can access maintenance, you can access laundry machines, uh, your booking day to day, your account details, and you can make any payments of rent or any payments in general via your My Unite app. What I, one thing that I tend to enjoy about laundry machines is via the model.
Do you want to talk about the maintenance side of things as well with the app? Yes, yeah, so for, via the Mining Right app, you can also log maintenance requests. So if you have any maintenance issues inside your room or outside your room at any point during your stay, you go through the My Unite app and you basically log the request and we aim to finish any request within two weeks of them being requested and then if unless it's an emergency and your say for example your door's not working, it will happen you we will try and fix it within an hour or two hours. Perfect. Okay. Study room. We're just doing a viewing. Yes, so obviously this is our housekeeping team here. Team have a world. So we also have the TV down at the end, as you can see. And this is likely to turn into a gym. Okay. So at the moment, obviously we have the charging ports on each table, which is perfect for the USB and just normal charging ports. But we also offer a printing service throughout the stay. Download an extra app, the app's called Print, and you can print for free from there or whatever you want. Okay. There's a plan for this room to be turned into a gym on site um, in the next couple of years. Thank you, guys. The print is free, yes. You won't have to pay for the printing as we um, provide that as part of our service. Okay. We've got them on selected properties. Sorry, Fenton, That's carry okay. on. Um, I just wanted to let you know, we are just about to go through the stairs and obviously where the network is not incredible, where the stairs are, we may lose you for a minute, but just bear with us, okay? Once we get up there, okay? Thank you. Hi guys, we're back. Can everyone hear us? Let us, let us know if you can hear us so we can continue. Perfect. Brilliant. Okay, so this is our common room area. So obviously this is a, an opportunity for you guys to relax, chill on the sofas and stuff like that, okay? Brilliant. Currently the space is closed, but this will be back um, operating again in September. We've had to close the area due to COVID, but in September, once the restrictions have been lifted, we'll be back um, open as usual. Benson? So, this is our common room area. As you can see, a lot of chairs, a lot of sofas, and we have our fat boys on the left, which are basically very big cushions. <laughs> and the TV just to the left here. Just gonna give you a tour of our common room. So we've got comfy sofas. Just to answer your question, this is the common area. Can everyone, is everyone okay? Can everyone see? Any questions at all about the common room? So we currently have um, only a small amount of chairs, again, due to COVID-19. Um, once the restrictions are lifted, we'll be able to put some more chairs back on here.
If you have any other questions regarding our communal areas, please just drop them in the comments and we'll be able to answer them later. We're just going to move on to our show flat, which is um, the studio. So this is our show flat for a classic studio. So you will receive a kitchen alongside an ensuite, okay? Just showing you guys all of our cupboards and storage spaces. Fenton, would you like to go through what's in the kitchen in the studio? Okay. So, appliance-wise, so electronically, we offer an oven, as you can see there. We have the four hobs on the top. We also offer a fridge which also has a small freezer in the top as well. And a microwave. And then you've got the bar area as well. Yeah. Okay. We also offer, with every studio you have, you'll receive a mop bucket, a hoover, and a mop, and also a ironing board. Thank you. Brilliant. Okay, so I'll show you guys our storage for the room effectively, where we store your clothes or just any belongings aside from kitchen belongings. So, as you can see on the left here, we have our first storage unit. So, uh, underbed storage, like this. Just to answer your question, um, this is a show flat, so our studio is, is actually slightly more spacious than this, but this is our show flat that's meant to show um, kind of the, the ensuite and the studio, but the actual studio is a lot more spacious than this. Um, and also we'll be showing you an actual ensuite flats as well. Um, so you can see what um, the flat looks like. The building is only about, I would say three years old. So we haven't had this building for a long time. So this is um, our newest building in Portsmouth. Benton, would you like to continue? Yeah, so we also have the storages up top. And we also have three small bedside drawers. And also some storage underneath your working desk. And we provide chairs for all of our students as well. Just to confirm with you guys again that our actual studio is, is more spacious than this. This is only a show flat. Um, one thing that I also did want to highlight is, unlike a lot of accommodations, our windows open fully extend out and our safety mechanism is the bars, whereas a lot of other accommodations tend to be restricted, so there's a lot less airflow in the room, whereas here you can max maximise airflow, especially on the hot days obviously as well. That's right, yeah, our window can be open because we have the safety bars, therefore you can actually open the window so that the air can come in. So this is our safety measures, we've got the bar instead of the window being restricted. Okay, so I'll show you guys the bathroom for now as well. So 
we've got the toilets, the mirror, got the sink, the mirror, hello there guys, and you've got the shower pod. Just a quick overview of the bathroom again. So all of our bathrooms are the same, um, whether it's in a classic studio or classics ensuite. Any questions at all about these, please let us know. Otherwise, um, we'll do a quick one more tour of this room and we'll move on to the ensuite. All these appliances can also be purchased via Unite Students as well and can be ordered before your arrival. Yes, so effectively we offer a kitchen or bedding pack for students when they check in. So it's an extra fee for you on your booking, but if you, it saves you obviously buying any bedding before coming because it will arrive on site when you're on site as well. And that includes kitchen or bedding packs. Just to answer your question, Angela, yes, we take bookings for undergraduates. Happy to go to the ensuite. Yeah. For everyone that's just joined, this is our show flat. Our actual studio is a lot more spacious than this. One last tour. Right. Cool. Should we go to the ensuite? Yes, please. Oh, the view, a viewer is questioning about the kitchen ventilator. Yes, yeah, sorry, we'll go back quickly before we move on. So, in our kitchens, in all of our kitchens, we have the kitchen ventilator here. So Fenton's just demonstrating how this is that how this works. So basically, above the hob you have the air vents, which basically sucks all the air up. It comes out like that, and it, you can turn on the lights as well when you're cooking. Perfect. I hope that's answered your question. If you have any other further questions about the studios, please let us know. I'll be able to answer it while we're um, moving on to the... Okay, suite. once again, where we are going to another flat, we'll be taking the lift. So the network service may cut out for a short time, but just bear with me, okay? I'll be back with you soon, okay? Hi, Angela. Yes, there is a... Um, do you mean the dishwasher or... or the shower. There's, unfortunately, there's no dishwasher. We're just about to cut off, guys. Bear with us, okay? We'll see you in a, in a couple of minutes. Well, seconds, I would say. Please comment and let us know if you can hear us. Hi, Angela. Um, there's, there's 12 floors all together in one of the blocks. And there's another block next door, which is nine floors in Chaucer House. So the highest floor is the 12th floor here. You guys can see it? Okay, let's go. Let's Brilliant. proceed. Okay, so this is an ensuite flat. So unlike the studio, you'll have multiple ensuite rooms inside one flat with one shared kitchen to share between everyone inside the flat, okay? And so we have ensuite flats with on average between five and 10 rooms in each flat. So you'll share with either five 
or six, seven, eight, or nine, or ten people, okay? start with the ensuite room, okay? The weather at the moment is lovely. We've got a lovely day today. It's very sunny. Um, you can probably see the sea right there, quite far away. But yeah, the weather today is lovely. Um, it's about 20 degrees at the moment. Um, we do get quite cold in the winter, but at the moment we're fortunate enough to, um, for the weather to be lovely. Um, Angela, just to answer your question, it does rain in England. Um, we did have quite a nice winter where it wasn't raining a lot. Um, it really depends, but yeah. There is a heater in the room. We'll just go through that with you in a second. So the heat is here, so you press the heat on here and then you control the temperature via the wall panel here. So effectively up and down. Right, do you want to go through what's included in the ensuite? Okay, Benton? so with an ensuite, obviously storage once again is via here. And then also we have storage underneath the bed. Thank you. And yes, also storage up on the top here. And then you've got a mirror as well in your bedroom. Just quickly show you what the size is. And onto the bathroom. As you can see, it's, it is almost exactly the same as a studio. Toilet, sink, bathroom mirror, which acts as storage. Any questions about the ensuite rooms at all? One quick tour before we move on to the kitchen. Yeah, I think one thing that we didn't mention either is obviously our notice board that we have here. So if you had anything that you wanted to stick on the walls, obviously I'd suggest sticking to the notice board. And also one thing that a lot of people do tend to ask is where the charging ports are in regards to the bed. So we'll try and make it as convenient as possible with the charging port underneath the bottom side of the bed. Just so you guys can do it easier while you sleep. And there's also a bedside light here for better lighting underneath the bed. Right, we'll give you one last tour and then we'll move on to the kitchen. Should we go to the kitchen? Yeah. Okay. Just to answer your question, yes, this one is cheaper. For um, prices information, please check with you, Holmes. So, as I've already said, uh, in an ensuite flat, you share a kitchen area with your other flatmates, okay? There you've got the kitchen.
Okay, so as you can see, you have your almost communal and kitchen area, so you can use this for chilling and obviously cooking. Once again, we supply Hoover. A mop bucket and an iron board with a mop also as well. These are the bar stools that you also saw inside the studio. Obviously here, where there's a lot more flat members, there's a lot more uh, bar stools. <coughs> Excuse me. So this is an example of storage within the kitchen. Just to answer your question, Angela, yes, there is package collection at reception. So um, you'll actually receive a notification. Once your parcel is delivered to the reception, um, we then log it into our system and you'll receive a notification via your email to let you know that your parcel is ready to be collected. And all you have to do is come down to reception and um, give us your room number, bring your ID, and you'll be able to collect the parcel um, at reception 24-7. As you can see as well, we also have two fridges for the ensuite flats. Fridge up top and freezer down below. Thank you, Fenton. Any questions about the kitchens at all, Guy? Give you a quick tour of the kitchen for the ensuite flats. As you can see, we've got Again, our window is able to open up. Just to answer your question, Angela, yes, you can check in at any time. Um, we, our reception's open 24-7. Um, we've, we've always got someone on site. Um, if you do turn up late, you still can check in at any time. Yes, all of our windows, you can open all of our win windows. We do think that you know it's good for students to get fresh air, so all of our windows are designed to be safe, but yet breathable. One last quick tour of the kitchen. Yeah, so additionally, in, in regards to the fridge, another line that we offer is the microwave. Um, so the kitchens, sorry Fenton, I'm just gonna answer a question. Um, so the kitchen itself is up to the residents to clean. Um, so if you share a flat, um, it is up to the flat members to keep the kitchen clean and tidy. However, our housekeepers do come upstairs and do a health and safety checks. So they'll check if the fire alarm's being covered or um, the fire blanket needs replacing. But other than that, in terms of cleaning, um, we expect that residents um, honour the tenancy agreement and keep the kitchen clean themselves. Obviously, if you have um, difficult flatmates, you can always raise that with us. And um, what we can do is obviously get in contact with those residents, ask them to clean a kitchen. But yes, it's, um, it's actually up to the residents to keep that kitchen clean. We don't normally um, offer toasters or um, kettles um, in this case it's just a show kitchen but we don't normally offer these um, in general Fenton um, yeah and obviously we do also offer microwaves oven, oven so, <laughs> <laughs> so there's two ovens thank you show you another example of storage as well, up in here. So there's plenty of storage for everyone. Just to answer your question, Angela, yes, all of our bills is included in the rent. So you've got water, gas, electricity, Wi-Fi, um, parcel collection, everything is included in the bill. Okay, so all we'll do is we'll go down to reception and then I'll just show you the last bits in the reception obviously if you wanted to go through the parcels again I'll explain that and then we'll just finish downstairs okay
our signal will probably go again guys so just bear with us and once we get downstairs Fenton can finish off the last few bits and um, just go through a couple of um, uh, other facilities that we offer or services that we offer such as um, the welfare service and parcel service just bear with us hi Angela the kitchen use electric Can you hear us? Please let us know if you can hear us. Can you hear us? Yes. They can hear us. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so we are obviously back outside the front of the study room and the laundry is on the right. And we'll just take you back through to reception just so you can have a feel for what it'd be like if you were to just be walking through the reception. Thank you for confirming. Angela, I will um, ask Fenton to go through what the £250 um, lifestyle voucher is in a second, okay? So I thought I'd just go through the last bits of services that we offer for people. So obviously we do offer our welfare team on site as well, which is 24 hours around the clock. And we also offer our maintenance service, which is also 24 hours around the clock. And um, in regards to promotions, obviously uh, Angela, I heard you asked about the £250 lifestyle voucher. So currently we are running a promotion where if you were to book with us, then you would get alongside your booking, you'd get a free £250 lifestyle voucher, which you can use on any mainstream, well, a lot of mainstream brands, sorry. And yeah, a lot of students do tend to like it because a lot of the brands are student friendly. And this is our mural as well. <laughs> and do you want to just mention that um, currently we don't have the £250 advance yeah, rent for so, Portsmouth properties only? Yeah, so as um, Tina's just said, we do normally run an advance rent system for when you make a booking and we are, current, we are currently asking for no advance rent when making a booking so there is effectively no, no fee to pay when making a booking. Um, I am going to wrap it up guys shortly so if you have any questions please ask now. Any questions at all guys? I'm just going to give it a few more minutes. All good? Perfect. Fenton, would you like to wrap it up? Brilliant. Anyway, guys, honestly, it's been a pleasure. I do look forward to seeing you all staying here next year. Okay. And if obviously if you do want any further information, feel free to contact us or contact you homes in regards to pricing and stuff, okay? Thank you very much. I'll see you later, okay? Bye. Just one quick question. Um, do we need to stay alone when go there? Um, does that mean quarantining just before we go off? Yeah, any other questions, please please feel free to get in touch with you homes all United students. Um, we're just going to wrap it off for today. Brilliant. See you later, guys. See you later. Bye. How do I turn this?